and welcome. My name is Alan, and we are back for more. Today, I wish to talk about a subject it seems like I have to harp on anymore. But it's getting ridiculous. Why... Are we having to choose between dumb and dumber? It's, it irritates me. Take your pick on which one's dumb and which one's dumber, Biden or Trump. But they're both idiots. Bernie was the only real option. And it seems like more and more his, his policies are being implemented, but they're scared to put him in because he'll tax millionaires and billionaires. Really? Trump has been very mediocre in his handling of this whole coronavirus, COVID-18 pandemic. Sigh. <sighs> I'll give them credit on the fact that the bailout, he wasn't going to allow companies like these cruise ship companies to accept money um, because they have their headquarters overseas to avoid U.S. taxes. I'll give them credit for that. That's good. These companies should be punished. They shouldn't get a handout just because they operate in the U.S., U.S. customers. If you're going to put your headquarters overseas to avoid taxes, you should have, um, you know, fines levied against you. You shouldn't be able to use bailouts. So that I will give him credit for. It's a good idea. Honestly, I think it should go further. You will not be able to have bailouts if you move your headquarters out of the U.S. to avoid U.S. taxes. And number two, you should have a tax specifically on your products because you moved out of the U.S., to avoid taxes, making your stuff more expensive and a little harder to sell. You know, most of these CEOs and companies are so spoiled, they act like spoiled little children. As I was saying, I give Trump credit for that. But the rest of it, he's been so lackluster and horrid on. Complaining because New York asked for 30,000 ventilators. He said, all they should need is a few hundred. Idiot. Idiot. Do you not? Of course you don't understand. In these pandemics, which 
the world hasn't seen one since about 1918. But in these pandemics, it should be about human life, not the fucking economy. Yet you whiners want to cry, oh, but our economy, we have to maintain it. <laughs> People's lives are more important, assholes. We need ventilators. A lot of them. Not just in New York, but several states. People are dying. People need these ventilators to breathe because one of the big things about COVID-19, it affects your respiratory system. It makes it hard to breathe. So ventilators are hugely important. And then, you know, they want to give him credit for authorizing this what was it? The, the defense something? I, I forget the name of the act. It took him days and days to do it. He kept thinking, no, we don't really need to do it. We don't need it. And then he finally uses it, but just to tell GM, let's make some ventilators. God, he's stupid. He's an idiot. Not just GM, you should have other companies doing this too. But he don't understand that. See, that's what a lot of people don't seem to understand. He doesn't give a damn about your life. About the average American. He, he does not give a damn. And they're like, hey! He's here for us. He knows Jesus. Jesus picked Trump. No. 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 You idiots are too stupid to understand that the media has lied to you over and over. Trump has been a moron in this situation. Clear and simple. There is no argument. And then the fact that his cronies, right and left, have pushed this giant bailout bill where most of the money is going to go to corporations and the average American gets what? $1,200 one-time check? Screw that! Donald Trump can kiss my ass. Actually, he better not. That's more of a privilege than he deserves. But yeah. And then let's let's talk about the other idiot who's likely gonna win the Democratic nomination. Joe I can't remember what I was gonna say, Biden. Creepy Uncle Gaff good Joe Biden. Uh The man, every time he shows up on TV, shows how worse and worse off he is getting. I ramble a lot. But when Joe's trying to say things, he goes off on a ramble. It's like, 
what does that have to do with this? And we know he has a history of gaffes, of screw-ups, of constantly saying things and doing things that are just wrong, that are unacceptable. But they keep trying to push him. And by they, I mean the DNC, the rich, the corporations, because you know they don't want to have to pay taxes like every other American. So they don't want Bernie in office. Biden, only, only reason I think he stands any chance right now is because Trump's flubbing this so badly. And Trump still, still will probably beat Biden. Like I've told you before, people, we live in a second Gilded Age. Everything in our news media has gone back to the age of yellow journalism. The rich own more wealth than they need. And they basically rule society. The deaths of the average American don't matter to them. To the public. To the media. To the rich. Oh, but you threaten them. Oh, oh dear. Oh, my. Whatever. And here's another thing. Andrew Cuomo. Not much of a better pick. There's some Democrats trying to court him into the race. You know, the, the governor, current governor of New York. Because they know Biden's struggling. But they do not want to go to Bernie. Because they're so scared of getting taxed that they're actually people trying to bring Cuomo in. That's how much they do not want to have to be like an average American and have to pay taxes, have to pay their fair share. <sighs> Whatever. Man. I'm just tired of these idiots it just gets worse and worse Trump's part of the same line of these morons who just enrich themselves putting in these monsters in line they cry oh he drains the swamp no no, he's filled it further. Any of y'all believe he's drained a swamp? No. <laughs> no. But yeah. That's all I really wanted to talk about. <sighs> Goodness gracious. As always, educate thyself, think, read, study, learn, my stomach just growled. Well, it's more of a whine than a growl, I was like, Rrr. 
If anyone tries to tell you anything and you're unsure, ask them to cite the sources. We are now in an age where proof is needed. Sources need to be cited. But I'll see you on the next video. Until then. Later.